Hello everyone, I am Shamant Goda, CSAT faculty at Insights IAS. I welcome you once again for the question of the day series. Today, firstly, I will explain the bones of last video, which was given as homework here. Find the unit digit of 2 power 8088. Very similar question we have done in the previous video also, but still I am doing the same. Look here now. Unit digit of 2 power 1 is 2. 2 square unit digit is 4. Similarly, 2 cube unit digit is 8. 2 power 4 is unit digit, 8 again multiplied with 6. 2 power 5, if you multiply 6 with again 2, 6 into 2 is 12, the unit digit is 2. 2 power 6, again we got 2, 2 when multiplied with another 2, you will get 4. 2 power 7, 4 into 2 is 8, 2 power 8, 8 into 2 is 16, unit digit is 6. 2 power 9, again 6 gets multiplied with 2 and produces 2, okay. So, what is the cycle here? 2, 4, 8, 6, 2, 4, 8, 6, 2, 4, 8, 6. So, the cyclicity of the unit digit is 4. So, once we get 4, what to do? Divide the power by 4. If I divide the power by 4, 8088, okay. Now, how to divide this by 4? See, always the divisibility rule of 4 says, check the last two digit now, okay. If the last two digit are divided by 4, then the whole number is completely divisible by 4. Only what to check? When you are dividing by 4, check the last two digits. 88, is it divisible by 4? Yes, hence this complete number is divisible. Complete number is divisible means remainder becomes 0, okay. Now, remainder is 0. See, even to the power of anything you do, you will get even number only. Odd to the power of anything you do, you will get odd number only. For example, okay, 3 power 123, you will get odd only. 6 power whatever you do, you will get even number only. Okay. Similarly, even power n is even, odd power n is odd. But here, if I am getting 2 here, power if I make it 0, 2 power 0 is what? 1. Okay. 2 is an even number. Even number to the power of anything, we cannot get an odd number. Meaning of which is, here the power is not 0, the remainder is 0. The remainder 0 meaning is, whatever you get for 2 power 4, 4 you will get the same unit digit for 2 power 8, 2 power 12, 2 power 16, 2 power 100 or else 2 power 200 or else 2 power 88 and so on. These powers are what? Completely divisible by 4. Look here, divisible by 4, 4, 4. When you are getting a number which is divisible by 4, power if it is divisible by 4 and giving 0 as the remainder. The meaning of 0 remainder is you have to take 4. Whenever you are getting a remainder 0 in cyclicity 4, you have to take the power as what? Not 0, 4. So, whatever you are getting for 2 power 4, same unit digit you will get for 2 power 8088. What is the unit digit for 2 power 4? 2 power 4 is 6. So, what is the answer? Option C, it is 6. Okay, keep this in mind. And guys, this is today's question of the day. In this one, 17 power 23 plus 29 power 23 is divisible by, okay. This is the concept of common factors, okay. I will explain what is common factor by taking some list and look here. A power n plus B power n is divisible by A plus B when n is odd. Similarly, a power n plus b power n is not divisible by a plus b when n is even. Okay. Similarly, a power n plus b power n is never divisible by a minus b, okay. a power n minus b power n is always divisible by a minus b, okay. a power n minus b power n is divisible by a plus b when n is even, 
a par n minus b par n is not divisible by a plus b when n is odd. Okay, this is what common factors of division. Okay, make this list. Using this, we can solve that one easily. Look here now. This is in the form of what? A par n plus b par n. N means the power has to be same here. Okay, this is a, a value is 17, b value is 29 and n value is 23 here. Okay, a number of this kind, a par n plus b par n. Okay, see a par n plus b par n is divisible by a plus b when n is odd. Okay, where n is odd. Similarly here, is the n odd? Yes, n is equal to odd. So, this number has to be divisible by what? a plus b. Okay, so 17 par 23 plus 29 par 23 is divisible by a plus b, 17 plus 29, which is nothing but 17 par 23 plus 29 par 23 is divisible by 46. Okay, 17 par 23 plus 29 par 23 is divisible by 46. Do we have 46 in this list? Okay, no, but what is the answer then? Look here now, 81, is it divisible by 9? Yes, sir. Then is it divisible by 3? Yes, of course. Okay, see, 32, is it divisible by 16? Is it divisible by 4? Yes, any number which is divisible by 9 also has to get divided by 3. Any number which is divisible by 16 has to be a factor of 4 only. So, any number which is divisible by 46 has to be divisible by which of these numbers? 46 is divisible by 23, isn't it? A number which is divisible by 46 means it has to be divisible by what? 23. Okay, 23 divides 46 means it has to divide 17 part 23 plus 29 part 23 also. Okay. This is the bouncer of today's guys. Try to solve this question using the same common factor technique and post the answer in the comment section. Thank you. We will see you in the next video.